Additive friction stirred deposition is one of those technologies that while it's been developing over a period of time, BYU is on the forefront of implementing technologies that are gonna allow this to move from a research center and a university into full production. We have been partnering with Megaster for over a decade and using their liquid cooled tool holder system. Our real goal with integration of this tool holder is not just to enable continuous feed aluminums, but it's to enable us to use tooling and materials that can allow us to deposit things like stainless steel or nickel-based super alloys. And our goal is to be able to demonstrate that, and we hope to be able to, in the next few months, demonstrate that we can continuously print without destroying the tools from the thermal effects of the process. So one of the beautiful things about solid state deposition is it has the ability to disrupt supply chains in a way that we really haven't seen in many years. Right now, forgings that were taking 36 weeks are now taking as long as 36 months. We're looking at a system that is breaking down because the number of forging houses have been diminishing worldwide. This technology has the capability of disrupting that supply chain and being able to introduce forged product in near net shapes and that ability to do that with both low melting temperature materials or moving into those materials like stainless steels changes the way that we'll look at how we go about achieving or getting forgings into the supply chain in the future. I think it's, it's gonna be a radical change to how we look at getting forged product overall across every industry.